All right, shout out to Arthur Woolwill with the Buy Me a Coffee yeah. donation request, man. We got uh, Little Feet, Spanish Moon, all right? So he says, my last request was Linda Ronstadt singing at the Lowell George Tribute Concert. This request is for Little Feet with Lowell George singing and playing guitar in the song Spanish Moon. All right, so um, kind of, I'm excited to see this, um, kind of like this full circle moment I'm having with these artists and. I'm looking forward to see what this is, man. I hope it's like a Spanish guitar and it sounds kind of reminiscent of like uh, Maria Maria by uh, um, Carlos Santana. Let's see where it goes, though. Oh, it's a live performance. Okay, got the bass guitar, got the bass going. Okay, got the organ playing in the back. Okay, that sounds like a whole band. Oh, that sounds good. Musically, it's so much going on in here for me to identify. I'm going to have a good time with this song. I like that sound right there. Down the street, I heard such a sound from the place they call it Spanish blue. I like his vibrato right there. That right there, I like that. Down the street, right there, that's cool. This song got a lot of energy. Stood by the door. Stood by the door. Got girls sang and played the guitar. There were hookers and I heard a I feel in the room. I heard about this place they call it Spanish Moon. I have no idea how I knew that lyric was coming up. I don't know. I think maybe. I picked on the rhyme before, but for some reason I just knew he was gonna say Spanish movie. I just I love the the, the energy in his voice. What is this? I gotta look this up on Wiki real quick. That sounds so good. On my watch, yet I sold my ring. Such a such a such a complete. It's already a complete song. Like it's this song was built for live performances, man. I almost want to listen to the the studio version and see if there's any uh, similarities in between that. But wow, this is good. This is really good. This. Man, this is like Vegas style showman like type of music right here. And this what 77? God, dude. On my watch, yet I 
This, if I had to compare liquor to this, bro, this this would be a Long Island 32 ounce. This that's that's what I compare this. This is a long third. This is a 32 island, 32 ounce Long Island at five bucks in St. Pete, bro. That's this song. I right, this this song got so much, and I like everything about it, bro. This is going on the playlist for sure. <laughs> I just, I just like how fun this sounds, man. Like you can dance to this, man, any type of way. Woo! I love hearing voices in the background with these live performances. I like, I like to hear the crowd support, the claps. People shouting and stuff from the audience and stuff. Like that's that's what makes this so special. Like Woo, I like the breakdown right here. Come on now. Yeah. <laughs> That's cold. I like that. I like that. I, nah, I like this a lot. This was This was a good song. That was a very great song. Um Let me see. Who requested this one? Um, Arthur, Arthur, you've been blowing it out the park, bro. I got to give you your props. I got to hand you your flowers, man. You've been knocking it out the park. You and Charles Davis, and uh, you, Charles Davis, Daniel, and uh, Connor Burton, man. You guys really been like laying it, giving me some good music to react to, man. This is what I like to hear. That's what I like to hear. That's my type of music right there. Um, just different. <laughs> Like if I had to compare, like it feels like just a bunch of different flavors all at once. You know what I mean? So, but with that being said, post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about this song, man. What you think about Little Feet? You know what I'm saying? Uh, I had some song facts to share with you guys before we log out. 
But he says, Spanish Moon was written by song and guitarist Lowell George, who was a creative powerhouse in the early years of Little Feet. The song is about a fictional place called Spanish Moon, a seedy club with whiskey and bad cocaine. Uh, but a girl singer that made it worth it. There are many dangers at Spanish Moon, but the ones likely to do you in are the women. So, uh, it says, Lowell George was actually uh, an excellent storyteller and created the Spanish Moon from his imagination. Say, But he lived through the vices he described in the song, especially cocaine. Around this time, his addictions were falling, starting to overpower him. His health started failing and he developed hepatitis. Feats Don't Fail Me Now was the last Little Feet album where he was clearly the leader. His contributions to the band slowly tailed off and in 1979 he released a solo album. While on tour supporting it, he died of a heart attack at 34. That's crazy. That's crazy. A man that talented never needs to go that early in life. Um, But that's one thing about those like genius musicians man they always seem to have a vice that they can't escape it's almost like an equivalent exchange like when you're so good at something you have like a very huge weakness you know um but yeah yeah so if you guys want to support the channel let me know uh let youtube know by hitting the like button if you want to support on the way to 100k please hit the subscribe button and support the channel also, if you guys want to support the channel monetarily, you can do it through Patreon, buy me a coffee, and PayPal as well. Links are in the description for you. Uh, with Patreon, if you join the ten dollar tier, it's a five and ten dollar tier, but the ten dollar tier also gets a free reaction per month. Um, and also, when you join as a free member, you get reactions that I do early. You may get some surprises that uh, album reactions I may do without even announcing it. So with that being said, let, um, feel free to indulge yourself on, on the Patreon. Um, but actually, at the same time, let's get up out of here, and I'll catch you guys at another one, okay?